Today's audiobook sermon, completion of September 6, 2021 video. Korean ministry message and English reading message, How Not to Be a Servant. First Peter chapter 4, verse 7 through 11. Use ministry message, How Not to Backslide. You are listening to KZT Cornerstone Online Live. My name is Newton Hu. As today's Bible, September 11th, 2021, this is preached by Pastor Daniel Shen. I'll be reading the narration that will be autocast through Facebook and YouTube channels. Today's Korean Mystery Message and English Mystery Message, 1 Peter chapter 5, verse 5 through 11. In the same way, you, are, you who are younger, submit yourselves to your elders, all of you, call yourself with humility towards one another, because God opposes the proud, but shows favor to the humble. Humble yourselves, therefore, under God's mighty hand, that he may lift you up in due time. Cast all your anxiety on him, because he cares for you. Be alert and of sober mind. Your enemy, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion, looking for someone to devour. Resist him, standing firm in the faith because you know that the family of believers throughout the world is undergoing the same kind of sufferings. And the God of all grace, who called you to his internal glory in Christ, after you have suffered a little while, will himself restore you and make you strong, firm, and steadfast. To him be the power forever and ever. Amen. You are listening to KZT Cornerstone Online Live. My name is Newton Hu. As today's Bible, September 11th, 2021, this is preached by Pastor Daniel Shen. I'll be reading the narration that will be autocast through Facebook and YouTube channels. Today's Korean Mystery Message and English Mystery Message, 1 Peter chapter 5, verse 5 through 11. In the same way, you, are, you who are younger, submit yourselves to your elders, all of you, call yourself with humility towards one another, because God opposes the proud, but shows favor to the humble. Humble yourselves, therefore, under God's mighty hand, that he may lift you up in due time. Cast all your anxiety on him, because he cares for you. Be alert and of sober mind. Your enemy, the devil, prowls around like a roaring lion, looking for someone to devour. Resist him, standing firm in the faith because you know that the family of believers throughout the world is undergoing the same kind of sufferings. And the God of all grace, who called you to his internal glory in Christ, after you have suffered a little while, will himself restore you and make you strong, firm, and steadfast. To him be the power forever and ever. Amen.
You are listening to KZT Cornerstone Online Live. My name is Newton Ha. As I read Bible, September 12, 2021, was preached by Pastor June Park. I'll be reading the narration that will broadcast through Facebook and YouTube channels. Today's use of message is What Happens If You Continue Your Backsliding? Deuteronomy chapter 30, verse 11 through 20. For this commandment that I command you today is not too hard for you, neither is it far off. It is not in heaven that you should say, Who will ascend to heaven for us and bring it to us, that we may hear it and do it? Neither it is beyond the sea that you should say, Who will go over the sea for us and bring it to us, that we may hear it and do it? But the word is very near you. It is in your mouth and in your heart, so that you can do it. See, I have set before you today life and good, death and evil. If you obey the commandments of the Lord your God that I command you today by loving the Lord your God, by walking in His ways, and by keeping His commandments and His statutes and His rules, then you shall live and multiply. And the Lord your God will bless you in the land that you are entering to take possession of it. But if your heart turns away, and you will not hear, but are drawn away to worship other gods and serve them, I declare it to you today that you shall surely perish. You shall not live long in the land that you are going over the Jordan to enter and possess. I call heaven and earth to witness against you today, that you and your offspring may live, loving the Lord your God, obeying His voice, and holding fast to Him. For He is your life and length of days, that you may dwell in the land the Lord swore to your fathers, to Abraham, to Isaac, and to Jacob, to give them. To KZT Cornerstone Online Live. My name is Newton Ha. As today's Bible, September 12, 2021, this is preached by Pastor David Shen. I'll be reading the narration that will be autocast through Facebook and YouTube channels. Today's children ministry message Children, the Garden of Eden and the Fall. Genesis chapter 2, verse 8 through 18. Now the Lord God has planted a garden in the east, in Eden. And there he put the man he had formed. The Lord God made all kinds of trees grow out of the ground, trees that were pleasing to the eye and good for food. In the middle of the garden were the tree of life and the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. A river watering the garden flowed from Eden. From there it was separated into four headwaters. The first of the, the name of the first is the Pishon. It winds through the entire land of Havilah, where there is gold. The gold of that land is good. Aromatic resin and onyx are also there. The name of the second river is a Gion. It winds through the entire land of Cush. The land of the third river is a Tigris. It runs along the east side of Azur. And the fourth river is the Euphrates. The Lord God took the man and put him in the Garden of Eden to work it and take care of it. And the Lord God commanded the man, you are free to eat from any tree in the garden, but you must not eat from the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. For when you eat it from it, you will certainly die. The Lord God said, It is not good for the man to be alone. I will make a helper suitable for him. 